everyone, Harley Quinn back. We are going to be doing a tutorial on how to do paracord keychains. Perfect for camping, perfect for gifts, for the family. This is the result. I hope you can do well, and I wish you good luck. Put you in position, so you can see my pink board. There you go. See my perfect pink board. This, the items you'll be needing are, is a lighter, key ring, and a nice long string. Okay, let's get organized. We'll keep this over here. Okay, first things first. You take this piece of string, put it through the keyring, and then you hold, you even out the strings, that's not even, you even out the two strings, and then get that to the end of the even two strings. And then, after that, poke it through about two inches or one and a half inches like that I'm gonna start with uh, two and it would be it would be easier if you had something like something heavy on it so like, I'm gonna put something heavy on it for it doesn't go everywhere so you lift this key ring up and you put this over here and this one over here but now you need this so if you need something smaller and you just you use your foot. So you put this over like this and then you cross this one over. Oh wait. Sorry. Cross this one over like that and then you put this one over. Sorry, I'm probably confusing you. And then Make sure you're holding on to the key ring. And put your pinky through there. Um, you put this strand that was over the loop in the loop. See, it's your first knot. If you if it looks just like this, you are in the right path. The right path. I hope you're on the right path. If not, just restart the video. Okay. So you see, when you remember how we looped it over here like that? We don't do it this time. We, we loop it over on the opposite side. And then you put this over it. You go around and back. So if it looks like this, that's your second knot. So, and we just keep going back and forth, back and forth, until, until we are reaching close to the end. So, continue to do that. I'm kind of slow, so you're lucky to have somebody who's slow. Many people are like really fast if they've done it many times, but I'm not. Oops, I did not backwards. <laughs> Everybody makes mistakes. So when you get really close to the end, you like you take take your finger through the hoop and then put your finger through the hole and you push or you pull. I mean, pull, 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 and then 
can probably fit one more nut in this. And then you see this hole. We are going to stick the two extra strings around and then up the hole. And then we gotta loosen two of these knots. So you're gonna loosen this string and this string just like that. See these two strings are loose. And then you're gonna go up and through the loose strings then wait for the other string and you gotta go up and do the same step with the string and you you may you may see a hole you see that little hole that's left you can decorate it you can do anything and so what you do now is cut it off Sorry I didn't say in the beginning you needed scissors. Completely forgot. Everybody makes mistakes. After you cut that off, you see it's all fuzzy and stringy. This is when the lighter comes in. Put it on the string, you let it sit, sit until it gets all melty. So you, as you can see, it is getting quite melty. Looks like wax. When you're done, press it like that. It's not hot, so press it on the melty stuff. And this is what it's supposed to look like. There you go, a perfect gift for your family. I hope you enjoyed. Please subscribe. Holly Quinn, out.